it's the two pieces of arrachera. Arrachera is a little cut differently than just regular steak. Uh -huh. And so, like, it's cut, a, it's cut a certain way. I'm not sure, but it's definitely different. This is what you would find in like a traditional Mexican cook. That's what you would use in This is the chile relleno that she was talking about. This is our peeled, homemade, boiled, and battered chile mm. relleno. I think this one's either for the cheese or fish, those are the two options we have. Okay. Of the three tamales, we gave you the traditional red one, and this one comes with pork inside, so it's like our carnitas that we make homemade here, and then mm. we also take about a day for each of those tamales we make. Wow. Same with those. It, it takes such a long time. Wow. Over here, we have two of our other homemade ones. This one is a newer one. This one's older. This one is the Diablos. The Diablos. These ones are a little spicier. These ones are the opposite of that, and these are our peels, so that's made with garlic sauce. Mm. Traditional rice and beans that we make homemade here. We have an empanada over here that we also make homemade here. Yep. It's the masa that you saw with the same homemade tortillas that we have. And we stuff it and those are the toppings that go with it. Mm. And then I have homemade tortillas here for you to eat with this. Okay, I don't. All the salsa right here. I don't know what to try first. What should I try first? Uh, maybe the steak, or maybe you just start with the, the smaller things and go up from there. Right there. It okay. needs a little bit to be warmed up. It was up there for two seconds. Uh, okay. Uh, and so this is called the who again? A chili relleno. Chili right? Chili right? Chili relleno. Did I just say? Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Chili relleno. I think I said that right. I think I got it. Uh, can y'all see that? Uh, I can't see. Can y'all see it? Uh, look at me. Look at the food. Can y'all see that? Let me see. We finna try this. It smell good. It look good. It's homemade. It's got cheese. Yeah. Smell good. You can smell the cheese. Here we go, y'all. I like that. Got got a little, got a look, a spice. I love this cheese. I think that's our queso fresco cheese. It's like a block of cheese. Like, mm. Stuff it in there. It smell. Mm mm mm. I feel like I'm at home. Like mm -hmm. I just went home. Look, I got all this stuff to, to try, and I keep coming back for this. I just, it tastes so good, though. <laughs> it tastes so good. It tastes so good. You know, I don't even need no sauce on it. Tamale. Mm -hmm. and carnit carnitas is in here? Yeah, it's pork. Pork. Carnitas are pork. Pork. It's made with our own salsa. Pork tamale made with homemade salsa. Y'all see it? Y'all see it right there? Here we go. Mmm. That pork is real good. It's really good. Got some good spice to it. Just a little bit. That sauce is good. It's really good. I like it. And I'm not really a big tamale eater but that's good that's good okay don't worry I'm gonna try one more thing there's a backup shot not that y'all see it I'm gonna try these shrimps you say this is Diablo mm -hmm. and this has been on the menu right but this is the new one all right Diablo, Diablo shrimp, shrimp, whatever you want to say it. Here we go, y'all. Here we go. I like it. I like it. I'm going to get this one. It's got a whole lot of sauce on there. It's real. I'm going to drop that. Oh, my God. Woo! Good right there. Try these rice and beans. Rice and beans is good too. I like the color on here. You know, 
this is basically like garlic shrimp. But don't worry, all y'all gotta do is say, give me the eat good local special when you come, and they gonna hook you up. Then you gonna get everything that we eating, everything right here on this table, everything right here. We gonna try that. Mm. Man, this, this got like some crispiness on the, on the shrimp with the butter going on, with the garlic. Oh, look, they even got the, the garlic clove right here. I'm gonna eat, the, I like garlic, so shh, don't, don't judge me. Mm, mm, mm. It's the Eat Good Local Special, so when they come, and they say, give me the Eat Good Local Special, this is what they all get right here. <laughs> Woo. All right, y'all, we gonna try to, we gonna try to stay. It didn't have enough time to rest. Now I'm gonna let it rest in my mouth. Got the homemade shells. I should have tried that first. Oh my God. These look homemade too. Oh my Lord. Do you see this? Can you see this? Do you see this? This is homemade. Oh my God. Oh, I'm excited to try this. I'm excited. We just, I'm gonna just cut a, I should have put it up to y'all. Y'all can see it. Don't worry about it. I got y'all. We gonna figure it out. We gonna, we gonna figure it out. We gonna figure it out, y'all. We gonna figure it out. We gonna figure it out. Oh, <laughs> I'm I'm slow. I got I'm, yeah. That made it a lot easier. Just get the steak knife. Y'all can tell I rode the little yellow school bus. Ugh. You pull it. Oh yeah, y'all see that? Woo! See the drip on that thing? We just gonna lay it down just like that. Just like that. Oh, yeah. scoop. Gotta get some red ones on there. That go a green one. Some more onions. Oh, I'm gonna put some sauce on here. I don't know, I'ma just grab one. We gonna grab the red sauce. So all these sauces is made from scratch. All these sauces is made from scratch. Let's be clear about that. Now we about to try this homemade shell. Now I'm so excited. I'm so excited about this. I mean, it look, it look good, it smell good. I know y'all like, just eat it. Okay, I'm about to eat it, here we go. Mm -hmm. It's like eating steak wrapped up in a soft blanket with the most seasoned bell peppers and onions with this sauce of this sauces. Let me go, let me right here, let me right there. Oh my. What the? Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Man, these shells is made fresh. I can't help but, these is fresh. These didn't come out no bag. Somebody was in the kitchen and mixing, and, and it came out looking like this. This salt, <clears throat> this looks so good. I'm gonna try it with the green sauce. Mm. Oh my God. With this green sauce? Oh my God.
Woo! They cooking up. Oh, y'all don't know what y'all missing. Hold oh, on. Oh. Scoring in all the right places. <laughs> this is good with these fresh shell. Oh my God, I've never had fresh shells before. The steak with the onions, the bell pepper, and then with this sauce right here, I I was I was I, I was in heaven at the door. <laughs> but then I tried it one more time with this sauce and the door swung right on open. <laughs> I mean, that is delicious. I can't stress how good these are. I said in the video, my exact words, I said it's like steak wrapped up in a blanket. Oh, that's how good it is. How uh, do you like the empanada? It's good with that sauce, the matcha one. This one or the? That, the matcha. Okay, all right. And it's the new one, right? Mm -hmm. Empanada. Y'all see it? Empanada, empanada. Okay. With this sauce. Woo! This this look like this is a little, little spicy, y'all. Uh, we gonna see. Um, should I put some, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put some of this on here too. Try to uh here we go. I'm gonna take a big bite, so don't worry. Y'all ready? Here we go. Give me a countdown. I don't need it. Mm, mm, mm. I got to try it again with, with just the sauce. I thought it was going to be hot, but it wasn't like real hot. So now I'm going to see it's by itself. Mm-mm. Mm. I like that. Hold on now. I don't need no sour cream and all that. Just give me this empanada with this sauce. They were lying. I didn't got a big guap now. At first, I was trying a little bit. Now we gonna, we gonna hold on. I gotta get this one. Yeah. Y'all see this with? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god. Woo. This sauce. I don't know, what's this called again? It's matcha. Matcha? I need some matcha. I probably feel like I got stuff dripping all on my face. Mmm. I like that. Matcha? Matcha? I don't, this, is this like y'all special thing? So you can't get this nowhere else. No, my dad makes it once in a millennium when he has everyone ask for it. Wow. Wow. Woo. This is okay. Matcha. This sauce, it's not even, it's, it's heaven in a cup. It's deliciousness. I love it. Matcha. And you, you know what the crazy part about? You got to come here to get this. You can't go nowhere else in the world. You got to come to cubiletes and try this matcha. Let me keep it simple. Just ask for the Eat Good Local Special and when you come, you're gonna get all of this. All of this. But tell them to give you two cups of this though, cause you're gonna need it. Oh, I wanna try with the, uh, I wanna try with the steak. I got it. After this, I'm done. 
uh, with the sh with the shell. Oh man, these home. Let me get a. I've been missing this in my life. Matcha and fresh homemade shells. I gotta try with the. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I mean, I thought, I thought life could get no better than this. And then I came to Cubiletes. Just when you, that's when you thought you had the life figured out. That's when you thought you found all the best places to eat. Then it was Cubiletes. So if you in Elkhart and you looking for some good homemade authentic food where it's like nanny in the back whipping it up because when I say these these shells you gotta come and get if you never you didn't never had a taco until you had it on a homemade shell. Cuba Lettes, I, Elkhart, get here. Like, when you see this video, come here and come try this. You will not be disappointed. I promise you that. <laughs>